all the flowers. <laughs> What do you think, Judith? That's grass. What do you think, Judy? Stopping to smell the flowers? Okay, I don't know what kind of flowers those are, so <laughs> let's not eat them. Ooh. Are you guys ready? Gonna touch grass for the first time. Julie doesn't look too thrilled about it. <laughs> Julie, it'll be fun, I promise. Okay, ready? Here we go. Ta da! Grass. What do you think, little John? Julie looks. I'm thrilled. Another week older <laughs> means another new thing. So we are outside today for the first time. And you can't even see them because of course they're all just here in front of me. But we are outside, oh no, we are outside with everybody, even Jude, who's trying to knock over the tripod, with everybody touching grass for the first time. We've always had the windows open the past week or so to let in some fresh air and hear the noises of outside, but this is our first time being outside. And I think they enjoy it. Oh, Jude, those are some tough bites. We need to get you a toy or a stick or something. Whoa. Not me. Yeah. Don't bite the hand that feeds you. Mm-hmm. Off you go. What do you guys think? What do you think, Jalal? Is that a good patch of dirt? <laughs> Some good dirt, Jalal? Blah. Blah. <laughs> Silly guy. But anyways. Puppies are five weeks old. We are now T minus three weeks until they're off to new homes. Six of them have homes lined up and four are still looking for homes. So Julie, Jeb, Jeff, and, and little John, all are still looking for homes. I'm sure with time, they will find the right home for them. That's how it always works and how it always will work. When the right home is around, that's the home that they are meant to be in. But we are outside for the first time, which is really overdue. But we just had so much snow up here that it, it was just too cold. I didn't want to bring them outside. But now we had a week where it was above 20 degrees every day. The snow started melting really, really quick. We still have a few patches of snow here and there, but majority of it has now gone. So we can be outside. And I think it's safe to say that puppies really enjoy it. Right, Jeff? Right, Jeff. My name's Jeff. Jalal, tired already? Me too, Julie. Judy. Oh, Juno, did you come join your brother? What do you think, Juvia? They're all outside. Yeah, I know you love being outside. an exciting day for her too because now she has a lot of room to play with them and this dog oh this dog loves to play
careful, she's gonna roll on them. I know. You're so crazy, Juve. Oh, you're rolling on the Juvia. <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> you're gonna smush them. Yeah, you're gonna smush them. You're gonna turn them into puppy pancakes. I guess we'll take a quick stop, quick break from playing for a little snack. Juvia, they don't even all fit anymore. I think the milk bar is gonna have to start taking reservations or turning puppies away. They're gonna drain you dry. How much fuel's left in the tank? Little John, you're just waiting so patiently. Oh, you see that? That was a mosquito. Jude is always upset. He's such a crybaby. <laughs> He's the biggest. Oh, yep, there he goes. Juve says, yeah, that's enough. No more crying. No more crying, right, Juve? Hi, babies, don't get food. <laughs> <laughs> don't knock little John over. Well, I guess this video is going to be kept very short <laughs> because they all got tired and they're all starting to fall asleep. I guess coming outside for the first time was a lot for them. A lot of new smells and a lot of new feels, a lot of new sounds. So it does take a lot out of them. We'll definitely be coming outside on a regular basis. At least before it gets too buggy because you can get eaten alive by mosquitoes and black flies here in Northern Ontario. And if you know, you know about the black flies and mosquitoes. I hear one now. Maybe that's a good time to say goodbye and good night.